Yeah, I should have. This whole sequence was just awful. Oh, you're another Fento, at least. The whole sequence was just sloppy, and now, like, he's gonna. So he found his cards, the draw cards first. Dandy hasn't hit Spiderling, so we or Tarantula Egg, so we can't just rush him. All right, there's a Tarantula. So he's probably definitely playing his Dinger spell this turn since we put another Fento on the battlefield. So we're dead in two. He can Dinger with Counter Magic up. Man, I felt really confident about this game, and then we just, like, flooded out again. Please, just once, one time dealer. No second counter magic. Just all the things, man. 17 to his 11. Up on clock. Yeah, man, thanks for reading. It's just gonna need counter magic and then we lose. First peak for 30 some odd cards into the deck. Yeah, nice. Not drawing peak feels really bad. That card's pretty important, especially like with how much blue threshold we have. And he's down on clock, so I'm just making him click through this because he's at 17 minutes and we're probably gonna play two more games here. So maybe we'll have a game where we draw similar amounts of resources eventually today. That would be, that would be sweet. Uh, spell shield and mill. What do I usually cut? Timer pull's not good in the mirror. Dinger's a little slow. Cut one extinction? Yeah, one extinction seems fine to cut. We got like this configuration. What uh, are you just playing the PVE Murphy, or did you pick up? Um, did you pick up one of the constructed decks? First, this is just for the type of night it is, huh? All right, this seems reasonable at least. at least. Hopefully we start drawing some non-shard cards.
This Oracle song gets verdicted, it's gonna feel bad, but I think we just play it anyways. And I'll start putting cards in my graveyard to activate our champion ability on. Alright, that didn't get countered, so that's great for us. It's possible you're supposed to save it to counter this peak, but I don't know. You guys want to gas up while we can. Next turn, we will go Song into Winter Moon Shuffle, play a shard. Hopefully, we hit a tap shard next turn. Glorphelia. Even just like a two to three ratio would be fine. Just like, not this whole like one to one to five type thing. Urjet, if we flood, maybe maybe he floods too. You know, we're going on three games now. This is so th this game set up pretty well. So we're doing a okay. That's actually a little bit punishing because I should have played I should have played a blood shard out one of the turns that I didn't, and then we could have played Fento this turn. I guess we get to play Fento with Verdict up next turn, so it's not all bad, but really wish I could have jammed him this turn. We got two Oracle songs in our deck that draw three cards now. Croc, sure, man. I think I just want to play Fento out still. I'll take a couple hits from this. Maybe that's wrong since this is since Extinction is our removal spell right now. If he has Ripple plus Counter Magic, we could be in trouble. If we untap with this, it's probably going to be most of the game with just these two cards in our hand. I suppose you could just have Windsinger here. Yep, you have Epiphany, that's fine. So he's digging for Ripple. And if we get to start putting eggs in his deck, then we're just an egg away from getting to kill this Crocosaur. So. Yep, sweet. So maybe we'll be really lucky and hit an egg early this time instead of taking forever to find one like last time. I'm, I'm gonna... Okay, Dad's gonna put you down in the packing play. Yeah, I think I'm just letting all of his things happen because I want to leave Counter Magic and this up. So we can take like three hits from this before we really have to start worrying about it. And then we can jump for a turn two, so. countering this because it could play possible tempo loss for us and uh, I don't want him to have more pressure on the table.
kills a good draw. Take care of that. I'm gonna mute my mic for a sec. Windsinger has the text that whenever your opponent draws a card, you draw a card. So you don't draw until, in I think it's like in between ready in the first main. Hey look, we finally hit a tarantula. Now there's like 12 in his deck. Took long enough. It's a shame that we didn't hit one of those in like the three cards he drew from the epiphany. So we have ex 